Tamarin is, in many ways, a return to form for both third-person shooters and 3D platformers. It's got traditional run-and-gun aiming mechanics which encourage a dynamic back-and-forth between you and your foes. It's got actual mazes, actual exploration, and scenery as gorgeous as it is immersive. It asks you to recall a time without blatant objective markers. It asks you to remember what it's like to be lost in a world overtaken by wonder and curiosity. I missed this. I missed this so much. There are even some pretty poignant underlying narrative themes to unpack, which isn't something I'd expected to say about a retro-style 3D action game. There are industrializing insects who invade, slaughter, and immolate the forest to erect monolithic gray factories on the ashes. And combating them? Only one vestige of the old, innocent world. A single Tamarin who dons weaponry not because he wishes to, but because it's the only means to combat such merciless tyranny. It's a traditional man versus nature tale, which deals with the corruption of wholesomeness and innocence. Except, well, in this case, man is insects instead of man. There's so, so much to appreciate here. So many games have pretensions at 3D collectathon excellence, or pretensions at capturing the splendor of retro game worlds, but so few manage to genuinely succeed, and even fewer tie their ambitions to a suitable narrative like this. Your mileage may extraordinarily vary, as always.